welcome to Mickey and my channel. Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Um, today we're gonna talk, uh, do a post review of those items that I did uh, from Amazon and that I did during the during October and November. Um, I think I'm gonna be a little behind January. I'm probably gonna be doing the ones that I did during Christmas and winter time because I'm still working on my Christmas morning and um, and I have a few days and I'm working on the poinsettia ones. So let's review these ones and then we're gonna have a fist. Uh, but I will tell you on my next video, okay? Let's go to the first one. The first one was a set of three, uh, like chicken farms. Uh, and if you can see far away, you are able to distinguish these items. But I didn't have that much fun of doing them because uh, they, uh, they kind of uh, pixelated the canvas itself. Uh, this one would have been even prettier if they would have been 30 by 40 at least, even if in round. I prefer square, but you know. Um, so, but uh, this one is nice. This is one of my favorite ones. You can see the rooster and the chicken with the chicks but uh it's only far away when i'm seeing it right now i can hardly distinguish this area you might be able to distinguish it but i i can hardly the only thing i distinguish is the rooster and the chicken so uh again this is from amazon this is a 30 by 25 the all three of them it's a set of three but I will recommend that if you find them on 30 by 40, it will be better. This one is another 30 by 23, and the only chicken that I recognize over here is this one. And whatever, this is it, you know. And this is a cornucopia with some fruits or vegetable. Uh, apparently, the setting is on a barn, so this is another one 30 by 25. This is also on a barn. Here's a rooster, here's a chicken. Apparently this is another chicken and there's another one over here. But uh, another rooster over here. But when I was doing it, I didn't recognize this rooster until I look at it far away. I'm still, you know. Uh, so these are good if you're gonna put it in a kitchen or somewhere in your farm or whatever. Uh, but you're going to put it to see them from far away. Close, you're not going not gonna to distinguish. And as you can see, I did a mud patch. Because uh, this one's like this, I put mud patch on it uh, to keep the drills. And uh, they keep shiny. Uh, they're shiny because when you put the mud patch, you're supposed to wipe the top of the drills with a damp cloth. And uh, they are uh, damp cloth, not cloth, cloth. Because then it will take the mud patch from the top of a drill and it only will, will get into between the drills to seal them. So that's why I don't have any problem. Plus makes the camber a little stiffer, which is even better to put it on a board. This is a guy that I did like a lot. Uh, many people wanted me to do this for the drills and shields on um, 2020, but the one that I did really prefer, it was the one that won. So, cause I put it on Instagram, on Facebook. I gotta create another page of Facebook. So this is a scarecrow, a happy scarecrow. I won't call it a scarecrow. I will call it a happy crow <laughs> with in a field of sunflowers. And uh, 
this one is a 30, it was a 30 by 40. And I have fun doing it because this one, you can see the come out when, you know, when I was doing it. So, and uh, as you can see, um, the drills are shiny. Again, let me see. This one is another one that I did the mop patch. But many people think that the mop patch will put the drills on dual. All depends on how you do it. Okay, comment below if you want me to uh, show you a demonstration on it. So that's the cutest guy. This one is one that I did for Thanksgiving. Uh, thankful, grateful, and blessed. Uh, they're a little because they were in some place that they were not good. It got bent over a little bit. And uh, this one I also have fun because I was able to see the letters coming out. It's not like you couldn't understand what I was saying. It was a 30 by 40. This also was from Amazon. And um, I wish that the background would be a more happier one, happier color, but it was okay. Uh, I did like this one. And again, I did the mud patch on it and the drills, I don't know if you can see them. The drills comes out shiny. Again, post in the comment if you want me to give you a demo of how I do it with the mud patch, okay? Here's one I didn't like it at all. First of all, when I did the unboxing of this one and I saw it, I couldn't distinguish what it was. I didn't even remember what it was that I bought. And as you can see, you can distinguish quite a bit. Uh, these are uh, turkeys. This is for Thanksgiving. Uh, I did the mop patch on it, but this is one that I probably gonna turn out in coasters. Cut it out, cause I don't like it. I mean, you can hardly see his face. I don't know if you can distinguish over there. It's just a blob of red over here, and uh, you can see the pumpkins around and some leaves and the house on the back and probably this but you have to watch it from far away so this one probably i cut it out in coasters you know do some stuff with it this is also a 30 by 40 from amazon i won't get this one i don't recommend this one to anybody okay and the last but not the least and my favorite it was this one. Oh my god, I need to stretch them out. They were in a basket, and the basket is not big enough for them, so go figure. And this one is one of my first one that I use for drills and shields. I love this one. This one I will frame it and then put it in a house on a fall. Uh, but this one, I even put some ABs on it. ABs over here, ABs over here, ABs over here in the leaves. Some ABs on the birds. But this one, I did love it. And I did enjoy working on it, on this one. And uh, this is a 35 by 45. This is a little bigger. So I'm putting it on the side so you will see. And uh, again, uh, this is very, very nice. I love this one. This is the one who won. <laughs> I thank God I was praying for it because uh, I did like this one. I love it. I love it. I put my heart on it. And again, this one, I use the Mod Podge. And look at those uh, drills, how they shine. Let's see if you can, yeah. 
because I don't have ABs on here. And look at it. But it's a matter of technique with the mud podge. So this is it. This is my post review of the Amazons that I uh, did that I unbox or unbag. And these were done between October and November of this year. So until next time, thank you for watching. Have a Merry Christmas and a wonderful year. Stay safe, folks.